So I just wanted to pop on really quickly and go over my Chanel backpacks, all my vintage ones. I'm not going to mention any of my um, current ones because I feel like those aren't asked about as much as my vintage ones. So these are all of mine right now. I have four currently and I just kind of wanted to go over quickly where I got them and then I'll just show you like the inside and like the details of each one. Bunny is chewing on my shoes. Bunny, oh. say hi to everyone. Say hello. Say hello. I bite and I'm mean. Look at her pink tummy. Why is your tummy all pink? Huh? Why is your tummy all pink? You guys gotta see. Um, this is her little toy carrot. Isn't that so cute? It suits her. So the first one I ended up getting was this black one. Um, it's black with gold hardware and I ended up getting it on Snob Swap. I'm going to link all these places below because I just find it, it's going to be really helpful for you guys. Um, I'm not going to go over price because I don't feel comfortable doing that, uh, but I will let you guys know where you can look and where you can get them and I'm sure you guys can find like what they go for. Um, on your own anyways so this is the first one I got it on snobswap.com and it is black with gold hardware and the inside I don't know if you guys can be able to see is like so um, it's just leather they're really tiny I found a penny in here um, actually I just threw the penny on the floor and bunny will probably eat it uh, this is my first one. I use this one probably more during like the day if we're bringing the dogs because they all are lambskin, which I hate because I they do get ruined. <laughs> like I know this one's gotten scratched by me personally um, because all of them pretty much came in immaculate condition. But this is the first one I got. It is awesome. Um, here's the chain, an up close view of the chain. And yes. So that is my black one. Um, I feel like that one's like kind of more like an evening bag one. I don't think I'm ever going to get sick of these bags. Like I know I've said that before and I'll get sick of something and then sell it or like just put it in my closet and not use it. But these bags I've been obsessed with lately. And the next one I got is my white one. I don't know why it's coming up. It looks like bigger on camera than it. Like maybe it is really that big I guess. But this is just a white one with obviously gold hardware. They all come with gold hardware. This one was in great condition. I got it from a reputable eBay seller. Two of these I got on eBay. Um, Snob Swap is kind of like a fashion file, but no, it's more like a tradesy. So like people can sell used like goods, but I would just make sure that you get them authenticated. That one came with not the receipt, but all the original packaging, the old box, like it was really neat. Even like the old tissue paper, it was so cool. I had never seen anything like that. So I do keep them all stuffed. Um, this one just has a Celine um, dust bag and then another Chanel dust bag. But here is the inside of the white one. And they all have drawstring. This one has a front pocket. The other ones do too. Um, the other ones are smaller. I can fit maybe like a perfume sample. And I usually will put my camera battery charger, um, my like camera, extra camera battery in it. But that's about all I can fit. This one you can fit a lot more, but like not a ton. Um, this one I just have the authenticity card and then another eyelash um, brush. So this is the second one. The bottoms all have the CCs. Um, they are adjustable, but they are shorter. Um, if you guys go on my Instagram, I will link my Instagram at the end of the video and below, but uh, you guys can see what they look on. I do have a picture of the pink one on. I don't know if I have a picture of this one on, but maybe I'll wear this one tomorrow and I'll post a picture. So this is my white one. This one came in like immaculate condition. I don't see really any marks like there's a little mark right here I don't even think you guys will be able to see that so they're all in great condition except the pink one is not that great of condition I would have preferred better but whatever um and camera actually looks really good but uh, in person it's like faded a little so 
and it has like some like brown marks and stuff but I also use the crap out of this one because I love this one so this is my pink one this one I got on eBay also um, I'm gonna link the eBay seller below because I love her I've actually bought um, from her before I feel like yeah no I bought another backpack um, from her before and I feel like maybe I didn't Maybe I just looked at things. I can't remember. Either way, she was really helpful. I wanted it overnighted so I could bring it um, to Puerto Rico with me, and she did. And so this is the pink one. Um, like I said, this little pocket. Yeah, I have a perfume sample in here right now. And then I can usually fit my camera charger, um, my camera battery in there. But that is about it for that one. And here is the inside. This will give you a better look on the inside. Um, it's leather and then in the corner it has a uh, what do they call it the like security tag thing and yeah it does say um, Chanel right there and that is it for this one these ones do sit up like high like like that's as low as it goes so like when you have like both straps on like it's like up high like kind of ridiculous like were people in like the early 90s smaller than they are now or is that like I don't know is that just the look I don't know so this is this one um yes I got this on eBay and I guess like the person she got it from um like had a huge Chanel collection and they were just letting go of a few things and that's one of the things they let go of but one of my subscribers actually told me about that bag they had like wrote me at like 11 30 at night and the next morning I woke up at 5.30, I saw it and I bought it. Like, as soon as I saw that, I was so stoked because I was looking for a pink or a blue one. I'm still on the hunt for the blue one. I want it so bad, but I feel like that's going to be the hardest one to find. And now I do want a gold one. I know I said before that I really don't want the gold, but now I really want the gold. So, because I want to complete my collection. I did see green ones online, but I don't know if they're re-dyed or something because I've never, like, seen... I don't know, I saw a red one too also. But, I don't know. If you guys know that if the green or the red ones are authentic, let me know because I would totally be into getting one of those. And then here's my newest baby. This one is silver with gold hardware. And here's the chain. This one is in ridiculous condition. Um, I got it from, do I have the dust bag? Oh, yes I do. Let me show you guys. This is the website I got it from. I'm going to link it below, but this is like, it's so it's a German website. I had to translate the website myself, but I did email them and they got back to me like after the weekend and they told me like that they could help me with anything I had questions with. Um, they all spoke English and I guess they're going to transfer or like have their website available in English soon, but right now it's only in like German is it I think it's in another language too maybe Dutch I'm not sure um, I don't want to like say something and sound stupid but uh, they were so helpful and the bag took about two and a half weeks to come at least and it was by DHL they shipped to DHL and then I ended up getting it um, I ended up getting it like USPS, like the postal mail service. So that was kind of odd too. But this is it. Um, let me show you guys the inside. So, oh, there you go. You can see what the inside looks like. It looks really good. And then it has the Chanel. This one is in like immaculate condition. I feel like somebody bought it and then like kept it and gave it to their granddaughter. And then their granddaughter wanted to sell it or something. Or like a mom gave it to their granddaughter or whatever. So this is it. Oh my god, I love it. My baby. So, yeah. Um, I actually saw one girl on Instagram. Like, so I was searching these bags like nobody's business. She was actually wearing it like this. And I don't know, I kind of thought it like looked really cool. Not that I would wear it like that. Maybe I'd put bunny in here. Let me see. Okay, let's see if you'll fit in here. Come on. Get your little butt in there. Oh, there you go. <laughs> She's standing up. You fit. Ready? No? Okay. I tried. So, anyways, I'm going to tell you guys. So, I since I am still on the hunt for a gold one and a blue one, this is what I do 
Um, I don't want to say I do it every day, but maybe like three times a week. I will go on Fashion File. These are my like main sites. I go on Fashion File, um, The Real Real, is it Yogi's Closet, and Tradesy and eBay. eBay, I have a notification set up, so any new Chanel backpack that gets listed, I get a notification of. And then I'll just look through and look at the vintage ones, and then if it's there, it's there. If it's not, it's not. But... Those are the sites that I mainly go to. What I also do is I go to Google and I type in like one of three things. I'll go to, I'll type in Chanel metallic backpack, vintage Chanel backpack, or um, Chanel 90s backpack. And usually I will scroll through the pictures. I won't go through the Google listings. I will go through the pictures and I will click on the picture and see where that backpack was posted from and then I'll click on that website. That is how I found my silver one. I saw a girl, um, so I think I'm gonna call it Lechenhausen. I think that's how you say it. Uh, they had, they have a blog and a girl that I think works for them was wearing this backpack in the blog and so I clicked on it and that's when I saw it. Um, and I was like, oh my gosh, so, like that's when I started translating the site and stuff. But that's how I found this one and now I'm like addicted to searching for them. It's kind of like, the hunt like I don't know like you know like girls like guys like for the chase or guys like girls for the chase like that's how it is with me these me with these bags I'm like totally after the chase so I now I will kind of like um direct it towards like vintage metallic blue backpack like or Chanel um metallic blue and I'll just scroll through. I know you have to scroll through like a lot of BS, but that is how you're probably gonna find these bags. Um, Snob Swap is another website. That's where I got my first black one from. And is it Vestiaire Collective? Is that what it is? I'm gonna link all of them below. But they also um, have them on there. And like farfetch.com has one and it's like $6,000. Like, come on guys, let's be real. Like. I paid like probably like, I don't know, like 20% of that for this one. Oh, and I remember I told you guys in my last video what I was gonna get hit with in, with customs. I didn't get hit with anything, just so you know. So I thought I was going to and I, nothing for customs and the bag got delivered. It was great condition and the price, was, oh my God, it was so ridiculous. So let me think, are those all the sites I go to? Yeah. Oh, in um no, no, no. Oh, Bonanza. Have you guys heard of that? Um it's bonanza.com. They sell like they sell like some Chanel bags and stuff like that, but they sell like kind of everything. But I will look on there. Although I have never seen one on there, I kind of just look because you never know. So, yeah, I hope that video I get a ton of questions about where I get these bags. So, I just kind of wanted to do a video on it and how, I'm not even sure. Oh my god, it's 13 minutes long. Holy crap. Uh, I just kind of wanted to like tell you guys. I feel like it was easier to explain over a video rather than writing everyone separately on Instagram. But if you guys have any questions um, about anything else, just either write me on Instagram or comment below. And also be on the lookout for the blue or the gold one for me. And I'm looking for a silver or a gold in the larger size as well. Um, the size of the white because um, I know they don't make the blue and the pink in this size or else I would totally be all over the blue or the pink one in that size. So yeah, I think that's it. Oh, Benny. She's her carrot. Oh. So that is it. Um, we are going to go out tonight for dinner. So we will see you guys um, in our next video. Bye.